All right, guys, welcome back to Mass Effect in brackets Legendary Edition. We you find us here on one of the planets inside the Artemis Tau cluster of stars, I suppose, and we're here to try to find. In fact, let me just bring up the journal to find Liara. Now, you may well be familiar with the name. Yep, if you've played any of these games before, you will know a little bit about her. So let's actually just check the map here because it looks like we've got quite a journey to try to find her. There is apparently something strange up ahead. I like the way that we get a little bit of wheel spin off this off this planet instead of the last one we were on. This one has got this one will allow us to drift. If only we can work out how to drive a little faster. It's not too bad though. By all accounts, the first game I mean look at this place. Just gorgeous. By all accounts, though, the first game's um, driving of the of the car or, or whatever it's called was was uh, it's a little sluggish, a little slow. But uh, it's vastly improved. The light effects are great. So thank you guys, as always, for for joining me. Um, this this game is already stupidly enjoyable, um, and I hope you're enjoying watching the series. going to keep on going because it looks like we've got a carved path up ahead for us so I don't really need to explore too much in case you're going straight on. This is like Mustafa. Uh. And apparently there are some uh, ancient ruins here which is where we'll find her. Okay, I see some redness. What is that? Okay, we've got trouble. Now, do we take them on? Right. If they just drop those guys down, they have. Right, I think we're going to have to drive up. Can I take them out with the... The car? Or do we... Yeah, I think we've all we've done is destroy the shield. Let's get out and take them on. got shields which is why it's appearing a little bit difficult to kill them wow and I'm getting a uh, oh I've been killed oh my god wow that was um, an early death okay we took a hit oh she's down Tully is she dead they're both down bloody useless All right, that is one of them dead. Only one. Oh, he's back. So they do heal. Guys, I suggest you take cover. He's down again. <laughs> Bloody rubbish. This guy's is ridiculous. All right, finally. Finally, they're both down. Right, guys, can you get on your feet? Okay, how do I heal? At least them? it's a dry heat. It's a dry heat. My people have searched many generations for a world to call home. If we landed here, we'd just keep searching. Yeah, it's not exactly uh, the nicest place in the world. How do I heal these guys? I'm sure I, I should be able to. Well, we know those creatures are, are, are pretty tough. If we have any more of those, if that was the way this planet is going to go down. We're in for a, a bit of a long old time. Is this already too difficult? Have I have I got too far in the story? Right, we've got a few cannons up ahead. All right, something we've got incoming. Man, this might take some time. I think I'll fast forward <laughs> if this is all I'm going to be doing. Sniping from a distance. Are they both dead? They're both dead again. These are rubbish, these two. Okay. That's two down. And you two, get back on your feet. 
Let's get back in the truck. Where is it? Oh God. The redness. It says we can't take it head on, so does that mean we're going to have to drive up here? Okay, so I can already hear more turrets. Where's that? There's something up ahead this way. Yeah, okay. Get back, dude. Okay, this <laughs> I should have used. My Mako first, it's far more efficient. Okay, well, the Geth. Oh, it's Geth up ahead. Oh, God, nicely dodged. Come on, come on. Backing away. Geth Trooper is down. Just doing all sorts of pirouettes with my uh, the ship at the moment. There we go. That's another one down. Or oh, is that two down? I think we've got two out there. Pretty hard to see, but they they do fall quite quickly. Right, what's left? Where's that coming from? Oh, I see something moving just behind this. Come on. Poke your head out. Oh god, what are you doing? It's a little bit too good at climbing. Alright, I think that one's gone. What's left over here? Okay, can I exit the Mako unless it's parked on level terrain? Well, it wasn't too bad. Let's go. And apparently I'm feeling fatigued. A gate control. Let's get around here quickly. Oh, okay, I see you. Switching up. He didn't stand a chance. <laughs> Storage locker. All right, let's see what we got. Uh, shotgun heavy armor. We'll take it all for now. Thank you very much. I think there's a turret outside. But we have ruined the gate for them. Come on, guys. I suppose I was right to be cautious, but then I wish I'd used my, uh, the Mako. Where's it coming from? What are you shooting at? Oh, that. Yeah, understood. I think we might need the Mako's turret. Let's get in it. Oh, well dodged. Nice. Now there's somebody else inside that building, I think. Ah, I've got another gate. So this is how we're how we're supposed to do it. Got shields. It's technically cheating. It's all over. Another weapon locker. Here we go. Take it all. We'll have a look at the stats of these things in a little bit. The gates are open. Now, are there turrets on the other side too? No, I think we're good. Let's get in the car, guys. Come on. Right, it's more of these guys. Let's see. We can take them down with a cannon. A little better than we did the last time. Come on. Yeah. All right. This is how I sh this is how it should have gone. I don't know why I bothered getting out and doing it on foot. What a waste. Still, you live and learn. run them over as well. Oh, you can. <laughs> Push him into the hot lava. Yeah. Oh, he's still alive. Not so much anymore. Right, Medigel. Thank you. 
pressing on. Oh, great. There's more trouble. Can't really see them there, but I know they're there. We've got a whole heap of them up ahead. It's a beautiful, soft, pulsing sound effect. Straight in the face. Right. He's done me. He's done me in. Come on. That's it. One more done. What have we got up ahead? Ah, right, some troops. We should fall pretty easily to this cannon. Managing... Oh, there's something walking down there. There's a big thing walking down there. Alright, shields are down. God, he got me. He got me with something. Let's just drive off, let the gun cool. Turn around there. Ah, oh, damn it, there's only a tiny bit of health left on this thing. over. And we got to level up as well. Get out of the way. Let's go. There is more redness up ahead. It's not over yet. So the Geth have occupied this planet. Look at this place. This is awesome. Keep, keep getting that occasional loading screen. You know, it just flashes up very briefly. I imagine it would have been a lot worse. Guess Rocket Trooper, what am I looking at? Oh, these guys. Move it. I'm over shoot. Move down. That guy. He's just over the lip of the hill. No, we got him. No, we haven't. He's not done yet. Oh, no, he is. It's all good. These guys behind, hiding behind you, and we've just run over this one. Gorgeous, beautifully done. All right, looks like we've reached the end of how far the Mako can take us. We're going in on foot from here, team. Providing cover points. Yeah, I can see why. Pretty bad at getting into cover. I don't know how we do this shielding thing. I don't know why I just sent her to do that. That was probably a mistake. But she is drawing fire. One of the rocket troopers is dead because of my excellent tactical choices. This guy, though. He's done. He can't both be in the same cover point, dude. Done. Oh, I think we've got one more. He moved. He's not supposed to move. I guess headshots are the best ones. That's taking the shield out. Yeah, alright. I'm going to aim for the head next time. 
my shield is is pretty low. They do, it does regenerate, I think. Oh, what have we got here? We got a dead Gek. Right, this guy, you just ran right in front of my shot. I'm trying to save your life. I just hope to God this is all worth it. Just clipped the top of his head, took his brains out, and painted the back wall with them. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah, I wasn't expecting actually such a firefight here. I was. I wouldn't have brought these two along with me. I brought these two. Well, just because I was giving them a turn, you know? I think I may have. Uh, Bad choices. Oh my god. What is that thing? some cover points. Straight in the mush. I don't know what that thing is that's creeping around though. That worries me more than anything else we've got here. Like this. Alright, whatever it was. I think we I think we just killed it. It's killed me! Right. Um A Geth Stalker. So at least we now know what they're called. Okay, one in the face is the way to go with these things. Yep, yeah, it's deaded. They seem to be doing so much more damage than anything else. That's the way to kill them. What, are you dead? Are you dead? Yeah, we lost one. He's down. Ah. Get me health back up. Right, what am I going to do with these two? Um. How do I get them to do something different? Battery recharging. Use sabotage. Use throw. Use it on that thing. Use throw. Yes, do it. Did anything happen? Not much. That shock trooper is not taking any damage whatsoever. Why? I've got to change cover points. I'm going for it. Run! Alright. Use this medi gel. Uh. Right, the throw was recharging. I don't think it did anything. I don't know. Try something like that. What is what is what is what is getting him? Ah, oh, there's a shield with nothing behind it. We got him in the leg. Man, I don't know if this should be this difficult. Oh, there's something up there. He's done.
Right, if it's anything like those other ones, it's going to take some time to take it down. Maybe it's got a weak point. We'll try the we'll try the glowing eyeball. I don't know. Right, can you do anything else? Use a barrier. Yeah, what did you stick it? Oh, you've got a barrier. Just it's just for you then. Okay, well that makes sense. Okay, I'm gonna go. Go, go, go! It's not the only thing that's here, is it? Oh, okay, we are doing some damage then. Just couldn't see it from a distance. Only a little bit left. It's done. Good. They're both dead, but it's fine. I'm alive. <laughs> there is good news. I've got to work out, though, how to how to use the tactics. Where are you? It's all over. Well, what a fight. You two, get up on your feet. Thanks for your assistance. Valuable as always. Hopefully, that's the last of it. Well, I'm not sure it is. <laughs> oh, no. There is more coming, I'm sure. Okay, okay. Guys, can you just take care of him? Why is he so damn powerful? Uh, there. Go for that. And you... Why don't you throw something at him? I will concentrate on healing. Soft kill deployed. Hey, that worked. Nicely done, guys. Alright, okay. This weapon from this distance is no good. Take him out. That did. Oh, I see you. One hit, one kill. What have we got left down here? I don't know what that was, but it blew up. I'm happy. Of course, we've got explosive barrels that I've just left. Completely ignored them. This is this is turning out to be quite the fight. It looks like this cavern formed around the ruin after it was built. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. Now they both they've all taken their uh, well, they all put their guns away, so does that is that a sign that combat is over now? You just stretch your neck there, mate. That's going to help. No, we've got more explosive positions. I feel like we're about to pick up some more trouble. Yep, here it is. An assault drone. Okay, one more hit and he's good. There we go. Going further and further down. <laughs> Synchronized weapon. What do you call that? When you put your weapon away. Why can't I think of words? Words are failing me today. I don't like the sound of those massive vibrations down here. This this doesn't feel good. Is this like a point of no return? Are you guys alright? Yes, sir. Good. What about you? You lead, I'll follow. You lead, I'll follow. You mean you go and get shot first and I'll hide. Thank you. 
Could somebody help me? Liara is asking for help. Can you hear me out there? I'm trapped. I need help. Dr. Sony? Liara to Sony, I presume. Thank the goddess. I did not think anyone would come looking for me. Listen, this thing I'm in is a Prothean security device. I cannot move, so I need you to get me out of it, all right? Okay. Do you know how? There's some kind of repulsion field in the way. It's a Prothean barrier curtain. I knew it would keep me safe from the Geth. When I turned it on, I must have hit something I wasn't supposed to. I was trapped in here. You must get me out, please. Okay, you brought this on yourself as an option. Oh my god. Uh, Benezia. What's Benezia? Um... Your mother is working with Saren. Whose side are you on? What? I am not on anybody's side. I may be Benezia's daughter, but I am nothing like her. I have not spoken to her in years. Please, just get me out of here. Investigate. Um, what about Benezia? Tell us more. Your mother is working with Saren. Whose side are you on? Oh, we asked her what? that already. Yeah. I am Fine, we'll, we'll skip that I may be Benezia's one. daughter, but I am nothing like her. Right, I have not about... spoken to her in years. How'd you end up in there? I was exploring the ruins when the Geth showed up, so I hid in here. Can you believe that? Geth, beyond the veil! I activated the tower's defenses. I knew the barrier curtains would keep them out. When I turned it on, I must have hit something I wasn't supposed to. I was trapped in here. Any suggestions on how we can help? There is a control in here that should deactivate this thing. You'll have to find some way past the barrier curtain. That's the tricky part. The defenses cannot be shut off from the outside. I don't know how you'll get in here. Be careful. There is a Krogan with the Geth. They have been trying different ways to get past the barrier. There is a Krogan with the Geth. I knew I should have brought Garrus. Right. How do we get past it? Can we walk through it? No, that's obvious. <laughs> Looks like... Okay. They're waiting for us down there. Well, I suppose we should just pick them off while they're easy. Yep, we started it. Oh, you. Right, I'm going for the explosives. Shields down. There we go. Right, I'm moving. I'm moving up. Oh, for goodness' sake! Right, come on, come on, come on! You got. This. There we go. Okay, there must be a switch, a lever. A way to free her. Laser... Oh, mining laser controls. Into the code? Area is not clear of enemies. But I, I don't have a code. Is that... Oh, that's dead. It's nothing to worry about. Okay, can we, can we enter a code? Do we even know the code? Enter the override sequence. I have no idea what the override sequence is. Um. No, it's not that. All that. Okay, A. No. A. X. A. X. B. Y. A. X. B. Y. A. No. A. X. B. Y. There we go! We did a good thing. Ooh, we've opened up a hole. That's the way to get through the barrier. That's what we call smart. Smart work. Now, is there any goodies over here before we get too far? If there's any collectibles, I should really be searching around for loot. Like this. Got it. Heat sink, radioactive rounds, sure thing. Another one. 
go. Scimitar and a Banshee too. Right, so we've got to go underneath the barrier, get the other side. And by the way, I do know, I, <laughs> I realise that fatigue happens when he runs. Look at that. That's, that's how long he gets to sprint. I didn't realise when we were in the um, in the other place, you know, the the citadel. I didn't realise that's what was actually happening. Right, we're in. Talia. Sorry, Liara. Um, how? How did you get in here? I didn't think there was any way past the barrier. I <laughs> think that's superior firepower. Uh, no, it, it, it's not important. It was easy. No, it's not important. We have to get you out of here before more Geth arrive. Yes, you're right. I've seen enough of them to last a lifetime. That button should shut down my containment field. Any idea how we get out of this place? There is an elevator back in the center of the tower. At least I, I think it's an elevator. It should take us out of here. Come on! I, I still cannot believe all this. Why would the Geth come after me? Do you think Benezia is involved? Saren's looking for the conduit. You're a Prothean expert. He probably wants you to help him find it. The conduit? But I don't know... What the hell was that? These ruins are not stable. That mining laser must have triggered a seismic event. Oh, great. We have to hurry. The whole place is caving in. Um, we, we need an escape plan other than just get out. Let's try that. Joker, get the Normandy airborne and lock in on my signal. On the double, mister. Aye, aye, Commander. Secure and away. ETA eight minutes. He needs to move faster. Right, we just won't tell them that we died a few times. In fact, I may not have put that in the video. Whoop, hello. <laughs> Sorry, Tully. <laughs> oh, no. Look at that, he's staring at it. The way he stares is just evil. Oh. Oh, maybe we can talk our way out of this. Surrender! Or don't. That would be more fun. Krogan Battlemaster. Now I wish I'd brought Rex along. Um so we've got we've got our ally. Um this ruin's coming down, what do you want? This ruin's coming down. Just get out. In case you didn't notice, this place is falling apart. Exhilarating, isn't it? Ah, I Thanks see. for getting rid of those energy fields for us. Had the doctor over. Whatever it is you want, you are not getting it from me. Uh, you want to fight now? No, I'm not giving her up. She'll stay with us, thanks. Not an option. Saren wants her, and he always gets what he wants. Kill them. Spare the Asari if you can. If not, doesn't matter. <laughs> Here we go. Right, get. Oh, we can't all get behind the same cover. Great. Right, switching up. Right, one down. Right, I'm, uh, that's it. They're all dead. The Krogan. I think I'm gonna get out of this. Run! Move! Oh man! Spare the Asari if you can. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna retreat to the back a little bit. Trying to take these guys out a bit more quickly than I did last time. Spot them. Got a shoulder. Right, man down. A woman down. She's 
she's not she's not doing such a good job for us up front there, is she? Alright, shield out. You can have one of those. Have another. Right, he's moving in. He's down on the ground. He's healing. Damn it. Right. Weapon's hot. Whoa. Gotta get that guy with the rockets out of the way. Which is done. I think he's down again. Is he alive or dead this time? Okay, he's done. That's it. Are we are we are we clear? Oh no, there's another guy here. Why is he hiding? Whoa, it's because he's got a big rocket. Oh, well, it's just a rumor. That's it. Whew. Wow. Well, we got her out. We're heroes. Too close, Commander. Ten more seconds we would have been swimming in molten sulfur. The Normandy isn't equipped to land in exploding volcanoes. They tend to fry our sensors and melt our hull. Just for future reference. We almost died out there and your pilot is making jokes? Well, he's called the Joker. Uh, but... The, he saved us. It's fine. It eases the tension. Okay, yeah, let's it's do that. It's a coping mechanism. You'll get used to it. <laughs> I see. It must be a human thing. I don't have a lot of experience dealing with your species, Commander. But I am grateful to you. You saved my life back there. And not just from the volcano. Those geth would have killed me or dragged me off to Saren. What did Saren want with you? Do you know something about the conduit? Only that it was somehow connected to the Prothean extinction. That is my real area of expertise. I have spent the past 50 years trying to figure out what happened to them. 50 years? She looks pretty good for 50. How old are you exactly? I hate to admit it, but I am only 106. <laughs> Damn! I hope I look that good when I'm your age. A century may seem like a long time to a short-lived species like yours. But among the Asari, I am barely considered more than a child. That is why my research has not received the attention it deserves. Because of my youth, other Asari scholars tend to dismiss my theories on what happened to the Protheans. Um, okay, I might know. Um, what did you learn? That's right. Did your research turn up anything interesting? What is interesting is what I did not turn up. There is remarkably little archaeological evidence of the Protheans, and even less that might explain why they disappeared. It is almost as if someone did not want the mystery solved. It is like someone came along after the Protheans were gone and cleansed the galaxy of clues. But here is the incredible part. According to my findings, the Protheans were not the first galactic civilization to mysteriously vanish. This cycle began long before them. Okay, and you know this how? Where'd you come up with this theory? I thought there wasn't any evidence. I have been working on this for 50 years. I have tracked down every scrap and shred of evidence. Eventually, subtle patterns start to emerge. Patterns that hint at the truth. It is difficult to explain to someone else. I cannot point to one specific thing to prove my case. It is more a feeling derived from a half century of dedicated research. But I know I'm right, and eventually I will be able to prove it. There were other civilizations before the Protheans. This cycle has repeated itself many times over. Hmm. What cycle? What are you talking about? The galaxy is built on a cycle of extinction. Each time a great civilization rises up, it is suddenly and violently cast down. Only ruins survive. The Protheans rose up from a single world until their empire spanned the entire galaxy. 
Yet even they climbed to the top on the remains of those who came before. Their greatest achievements, the mass relays and the citadel, are based on the technology of those who came before them. Oh, wow. And then, like all the other forgotten civilizations throughout galactic history, the Protheans disappeared. I have dedicated my life to figuring out why. Oh, look at that. I know what happened. <laughs> I know what happened. Oh, shut up and I'll tell you. Oh my god. Right, I can help. I can help. They were wiped out by a race of sentient machines. The Reapers. The... the Reapers? But I have never heard of... How do you know this? What evidence do you have? Okay, I had a vision. The beacon, the beacon, yes. There was a damaged Prothean beacon on Eden Prime. It burned a vision into my brain. I'm still trying to sort out what it all means. Visions? Yes, that makes sense. The beacons were designed to transmit information directly into the mind of the user. Finding one that still works is extremely rare. No wonder the Geth attacked Eden Prime. The chance to acquire a working beacon, even a badly damaged one, is worth almost any risk. But the beacons were only programmed to interact with Prothean physiology. Whatever information you received would have been confused, unclear. I am amazed you were able to make sense of it at all. A lesser mind would have been utterly destroyed by the process. You must be remarkably strong-willed, Commander. Okay, oh, this Commander. isn't helping us find Saren or the Conduit. Of course, you are right. I am sorry, my scientific curiosity got the better of me. Unfortunately, I do not have any information that could help you find the Conduit or Saren. Okay. So... <laughs> <laughs> so what good are you? No, you can help us. I don't know why Saren wanted you out of the picture, but I think we'll be a lot better off if we bring you along. Thank you, Commander. Saren might come after me again. I cannot think of anywhere safer than here on your ship. And my knowledge of the Protheans might be useful later on. And her biotics will come in handy when the fighting starts. Yes, welcome aboard. Oh, look at that, you can come. Great. Another alien. <laughs> Good to have you on the team, Liara. Thank you, Commander. I am very grateful. Oh, I am afraid I am feeling a bit lightheaded. When was the last time you ate or slept? Dr. Chakwa should take a look at you. It is probably just mental exhaustion, coupled with the shock of discovering the Protheans' true fate. I need some time to process all this. Still, it could not hurt to be examined by a medical professional. It will give me the chance to think things over. Are we finished here, Commander? Yeah, we'll we'll finish for now. Go go get go get some sleep. We can talk again after you've seen the doctor. The rest of you, dismissed. Mission reports are filed, Commander. You want me to patch you through to the council? Uh, yeah. Huh? Patch him through, Joker. Setting up the link now, Commander. We've received your report, Commander. I understand Doctor Tassoni is on the Normandy. I assume you're taking the necessary security precautions. Uh, that's not necessary, or she wants to help us. Just say it's not necessary. You've assessed the situation. Liera's on our side. The Geth were trying to kill her. Benezia would never allow Saren to kill her daughter. Maybe she doesn't know. Or maybe we don't know her. We never expected she could become a traitor. At least the mission was a success. Apart from the utter destruction of a major Prothean ruin. Was that really necessary, Shepard? <laughs> Yes. The Geth were crawling all over those ruins. We were lucky to make it out alive. Of course, Commander. The mission must always take priority. Good luck, Commander. Remember, we are all counting on you. Yep, the pressure is clear. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching. We have got ourselves a full crew, I believe. But guys, thank you so much for watching. Uh, it, that was that was pretty epic. A huge fight, and um, it just shows you diff the difficulty of the, the combat in the game. Even though it looks straightforward, obviously I've got a lot to learn. I have to learn a bit how to use the tactics better. But I seem to remember when I played Mass Effect, I didn't use them that much at all. I just ended up going all out, guns blazing, just trying to shoot my way through. But there's smarter ways to uh, to use the, the the skills of the team, and I'm I'm just not doing it yet. I'll get there. But thanks for watching. Please do leave a like if you can, and I will see you in the next part. Thanks a lot. Good night.